Hello viewers and welcome to today's review of a new decoder that our club bought. Now this is a a lap timing system. It's sold by a company called Vostok Electronics. They're based in Lithuania. And the reason why our club bought this uh, decoding system, and I'll just show a picture here, uh, it works the same as a, an AMBRC decoder. So it can do all the old AMBRC transponders. It can do the new hybrids. Now it's not going to work with the latest three wire RC4, but it'll work with the MRT transponders. So this is exactly what our club is after. And it's about a thousand dollars US, which is well under the the MyLaps one. I started to open the box. I thought there was going to be a a packing box inside it. But I was so excited to do this review that I started to open it and then I realized, oh no, it was just packed in a in a standard box. So we'll take a look and see what's in the box. This is going to be a two-part review. One is what you get in the box, and then the next is going to be us trying it out at the track, making sure everything works. Uh, so the, the decoder itself is supposed to come complete with loops. We can see some 10 meters a loop, detection loop. Here's the actual loop wire that, that runs underneath the track, I believe. This is coaxial cable, 8 meters. And I think this is the box that I expected in, in the packing box, which is the decoder system itself, which you can see is pretty small. Let's take a look. Yep, shipping labels for was seven hundred and fifty dollars US to get for the machine itself. I'm sure that the price changes a little on his site. You can see the logo on it. V-Stock Electronics, solid aluminum case, see the different attachments on the back for that coax cable, network, um, USB connector to the computer, power cord. I got a, probably the manual drivers and such on disc. See what else we have in here. Oh, bonus of two transponders. When I brought it, there was a sale on a site. So I'll put the site in the, a link to a site in the comments uh, description below. And maybe there'll be a sale when you guys take a look. So we got three transponders in the box. Now these transponders work with his system. I don't think they work with a MyLab system. A fourth transponder. So... So in the deal here, we actually got four. So we above and beyond. And we got some more wiring. Uh, earphone, set of earphones. Unexpected. A power cord. Now I do notice that the power cord is has a U.S. plug or a European plug on it. I wonder if that's just an adapter. Let's just take it out of the bag and see. No. It is a it is a plug, but this is kind of what we expected. Uh, the the club bought uh, it, all you need for output is a twelve volt two amp power supply, which every driver has one of those. We got that. We got the little stand to put it on. We have a remote antenna. This is also wireless. This little guy, so you can hook it up wireless feed to your laptop here is the usb cable he even gave us some feet a screwdriver to put it together networking cable in case we've got to use a network cable for a power supply if you wanted to to run it just off 12 volt say you're at the out at the field didn't have source of power Plug it into your car. Perfect. And 
in case you want to run it off a battery or something I suppose this has the connector plus just a, an end lead that you can put it plug it into a battery anything that's 12 volt so I'm excited to get this up and running so part two of the video will be this in action and what we're gonna do is we have members of our of our club that have uh, the MRT transponders AMBRC transponders and we also have some members with the the RC4 hybrid transponders and we'll double check that everything works and we'll report back with this in operation thanks for watching look for part two